You know what? I like the familiarity. I, I like Derek playing somewhere that he's very comfortable. I think the last few seasons have been very difficult for him. And I, I'd like to see him land somewhere and get the playing the kind of basketball that we feel that he can get back to. Uh, it's been a tough couple of years for the kid. Is that because of him, though, or because of the team he's got? I, I think it's because of injuries, for one. But, yeah, it's, it's the team that he played for, too, didn't help. I like this. I mean, he's, he's going back to play for a coach that, mm. you know, he's familiar with. Um, had his best years on the tips. Derrick Rose got a lot of basketball. MVP. Left, yeah, he know. does. I'm not saying he's a bad player. He's he's a solid player, but how much does he help the Wolves? Does is, I feel like that's lateral. You think? I think it's With lateral. With the young guys that they have on there? I think you need a point guard that can stretch the floor. You got Wiggins and you got Cat. There's, those Levine. are your franchise players. Those are your 20-point scorers. So if you Levine. got a point guard. Don't forget Levine. Now. Levine. So I if you got if you had another body of a, a a player that needs the ball to score, how, how do you keep the development of them uh, moving I, forward? No, we forgot about Chris Dunn. Well, they Dunn. Yeah, Chris Dunn's Dunn's so how, if Derrick Rose is ready to come in and be a backup, uh, yeah. Okay, I like it. I like it. You got to develop your young players. Right. Right, mom. We'll have to see.